video i'm going to show you how to do scrolling credit like the one you see on the screen right now it's super easy not complicated let's get straight right on to it scroll is text effect which is a cinematic thing you see when you watch movie the first thing you do is to put in your background as you can see we have this background already on our timeline second thing you want to check out is the length of the scrolling credits how long do you want it to be how long of a movie cast do you have and the rest that will determine the speed the length and every other thing now that we have that what we want to do is to come to overlay all right and we're going to bring in our credits which we already created which is this one remember you want to design this in somewhere like canva for instance and when you design it in canva you can add your logos and the rest then you bring it into CapCut. as now you can see it's about three seconds so i'm going to increase it as you can see to about one minute right i'm going to increase it to about one minute just like that the next step i want to do is to get out the colors so i'll go to cut out and once again i'll click on the chroma key i'll select the green like so and i'm going to click on intensity and just drag to about 14 15 that works right so now we're going to place click on ok so now you can see we have the scrolling text but it's not moving so that's where we want to go to the beginning of the frame increase it as much as you want to see it clearly and then what we want to do next for instance is to ensure we move it almost away from the frame they want to click on keyframe which is the triangle we see with the plus at the top i will just highlight that quickly so this is it this is the keyframe that's where we want to click up that's where we want to click and then we want to click on that for the first keyframe and then we'll move to the end of where we want it to stop and then we'll drag our gonna drag our keyframe up that way make sure you are following the guide you see on the screen and move it to the very end ensure you are moving it in same pattern and ensure it stays in the middle so that's how and now once we are done with that i will go to the beginning and play it this is what we'll get it's as simple as that not complicated at all the next thing we want to do is to export and there you go, we have our scrolling text ready for us. See you on the next tutorial.